Yeah, so on the way back to the southern section of Route 9, I accidentally ran into the swimmer. I'm all rested up, so how about you be my opponent? Yeah. I mean, we lost eyes, so we have to battle. <laughs> yeah, I went back and I fully healed my team. I also spent a lot of Poké Dollars on Ultra Balls and healing items. <laughs> I feel like I needed it after all those healing items I spent on that dumb eyes. <laughs> yeah, we got Remoraid. Yeah. You thankfully should be easy to take out. But yeah, we are gonna go back and rebattle all the trainers and explore this area. You know, once we get to the next town. Octori. Yeah, we have no reason to switch out. Because Voltapper can kind of sweep these water types. <laughs> yeah, we got all 42 on Voltapper, and Akuma got a level up. Nice. Antine. Yeah, you should definitely be... I don't know if the term would be quad weak, because I know I use that with Snover. But yeah, it's a water flying type. Yeah, you're down. I'm a mermaid! I want to return to the ocean! Yeah, she seems pretty mad about that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I mean, maybe she's secretly a mermaid in disguise. <laughs> I was looking for berries to let my Pokemon hold. <laughs> well, I mean, there's a berry tree right here! <laughs> yeah, you know what? Sure. <laughs> uh, Pataya. Apricot and agave. Alright, yeah, we're just gonna get these berries and move along. Yeah, we could keep the chain going, but then we potentially could run into an encounter and then lose out on those berries, so I kinda don't wanna do that. Yeah, onwards to the shore. Yeah, we're in much better shape to battle Marnie now than we were before. <laughs> They always say that. Um, what actually? You're a double battle, right? Um, yeah, we'll put uh, Volt Pepper and Shadow Claw in here. Sing, dance! Let's make this a party hall! If I dance, I shine! My Pokemon shines brighter, too! Yeah, so we got the music crew. <laughs> yeah, Toxtricity. Oh, you have a Toxtricity of your own, and a Maractus. <laughs> yeah, it's not a good tight matchup for Volt Zapper. <laughs> yeah, but we get to see the other Toxtricity, because I didn't mention that there were two forms. Yeah, we got the low-key one, but... Yeah, it looks like they've got the amped up form of Toxtricity. <laughs> yeah, this is not going to be very effective at all, so... Ugh. Kind of a tough one. Um, because I could put Kamiya out there, but... Then I could possibly get one shot by an electric move. We'll do Poison Jab on the Maractus, and... I'll Surrender with Toxtricity. Oh, I'm glad I did that, because it's actually super effective. Ouch. <laughs> uh, yeah, 
my toxicity is not gonna do much against theirs. Um. <laughs> Critical hit. <laughs> yeah, well, it didn't really matter either. Yeah. Yeah, we got some level up. Shadow Claw going 44, and Snowball got a level up. If a Pokemon and moves are mixed in too, we'll have an amazing vibe. Dancing is the best way to stay healthy. <laughs> yeah, I mean, doing any activity, I feel like, would do the same thing. Who cares about Goozy? Guess I'll just sing an annoying song. <laughs> yeah, I could name a few of those. <laughs> I wouldn't have lost if it was a dance battle. We should both focus on our strengths. Yeah. Yeah, let's heal up and then we can uh, battle Marnie at long last. <laughs> yeah, we got some new berries as well. Um, yeah, it looks like they're stat increasing ones. Which I don't think we need to use them right now. Might as well switch our lead out as well. I feel like that would be helpful. Um, yeah, we haven't really used Snowball all that much. So we'll put her in the lead. Alright, I'm ready for you, Marnie! I was spawned here, so I know another way in. If you want to get into the town, how about to show you the way? But you're my rivals, and you'll have to beat me in a battle first. Got it. With pleasure! Uh, <laughs> yeah, you've got your fan club. You've had a pretty good win streak in the gym challenge, just like me. I respect you as my rival and all that, but I got too much at stake to go around losing now. Yeah. <laughs> think your fan club's gonna help you here, Marnie. Yeah. It's been a bit since we challenged you, actually. <laughs> Uh, she's got a lie apart. <laughs> I powered up a whole lot. I'm gonna beat you lot into the ground. Got it? <laughs> yeah, whatever you say, Marnie. <laughs> yeah, we got options here on how to deal with you. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go for the potential flinching with Headbud. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> Yeah, is she gonna sucker punch twice in a row? Ah. Oh wow, she is. <laughs> oh, how do we survive that? <laughs> oh my gosh. Um. Huh? Yeah, I'm gonna take the time to heal up here. <laughs> Torment. <laughs> uh. I mean, I wasn't planning on not using attacking moves. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Well played. I'm gonna go for Ice Punch. I don't trust Blizzard to hit. <laughs> oh my gosh. Thank you. <laughs> Yeah, we're gonna have to switch out, most likely. And level 43. Uh, Scrafty! Yeah, you're fighting in a dark type? Um... Yeah, I think Kamiya's got this. Air slash. I don't think confusion's gonna do anything. Critical hit. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I forgot about that. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah. Alright, well. <laughs> Yeah, 
Yeah, I mean, Scrafty's almost out, so anybody could really come in here. Uh, Dragon Breath, actually. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, but does not do a lot of damage, though. I kind of want to see if her Scrafty has a fighting move. It doesn't. Ugh. Either that or it's trying to stall me. Oh! Yes, thanks, Kronos. Didn't really need to be confused. <laughs> yeah, here's the hope we get a better water type move soon. Because water gun ain't cutting it for this point in the game. I'll tell you that. Yeah, we could go back in the wild area and grind for surf. That's at least an option. Yeah, but it does involve, uh, visiting the, uh, the traveling walk guy. Ouch. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna heal up. Very grateful that uh, her other attacks aren't doing nearly as much damage. Yeah, it wasn't enough. I figured. Uh, I don't think it really matters, personally. Oh, we'll go for Bolt Zapper. Yeah, but it's kind of stinks because half my team is not getting the experience. <laughs> so I might want to change that. Uh, Toxicroak. Yeah, um, the Kuma has this. <laughs> Yeah, we have our new item now that will uh, increase our fighting type power. Oh, barely! I should have went for the close combat, actually. Ugh. I think my best play is to heal up Kamiya. <laughs> you yeah, know, I'm gonna be a scapegoat here, unless Krogon. Yeah, I think I'm gonna be doing that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Kamiya should have no problem taking you out. I hope. You know, unless I get outsped. Uh, do I wanna go for the confusion or the air slash? Mm, probably the confusion. Oh, you have Sucker Punch! Oh! My gosh. <laughs> Alright, I guess Bolt Zapper's doing this. Again. Why well, don't go for the Discharge? I'm angry. <laughs> Still has one more Pokemon after this, so this could be dangerous. <laughs> yeah, that's already dangerous as it is being confused. Oh no. Yeah, she's got a more Pico! I am actually gonna stay in. As expected of my rival, you really know how to get me riled up! 
Yeah, we got more Pico, the electric dark type. <laughs> yeah, poison jab is gonna be very effective. We're gonna go for that. <laughs> you know, if anything, at least her electric attacks shouldn't be very effective. Ah! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Guess your more Pico doesn't have good defense. <laughs> What's with that? My Pokemon didn't get a chance to really do the thing at all. Ah! Yeah, I mean, you KO'd half my team. I wouldn't sell yourself short of that. <laughs> my partner, Morpico, has been interested in you and your strength, and I think I get it now. But I've got everyone in Spike Muff supporting me. I'm definitely gonna get all eight gym badges just so I can have a rematch with you. Don't you forget it. I'll get my revenge in the Champion Cup. Anyway, I promised I'd show you a way in, so follow me! Yeah. Made our way into Spike Muff at long last. <laughs> yeah, this reminds me a little bit of the movie West Side Story. <laughs> You know, maybe not so much the concept of, like, two different gangs fighting against each other, but just, I don't know, it just kind of does a little bit. Welcome to the town of Spike Muff. This rocking town is a punk, punk vibe and streets crammed with shops lined up cheek by joy. Yeah. Yeah, this is one of the towns, or I guess the only town in this game that you can't really explore much of. There's just a Pokemon Center. <laughs> yeah. I'll always be grateful for the opportunity to heal on my team, though. <laughs> always say that. Yeah, anything new in the shop? <laughs> I feel like I keep checking this, like, clockwork in there. Nope. <laughs> Oh yeah, we got Team Yelgrons. <laughs> Any trader who's made it all the way to Spike Muff's got a right wicked look to them. <laughs> yeah. Well, you made it here, so I guess there's nothing to be done. You better be ready to face peers. Yeah, spoiler alert. <laughs> For the gym leader. <laughs> yeah. Ew. Don't you dare make Barney's Morpico cry, okay? <laughs> uh. Yeah, I think it's been through enough with my team constantly. Yeah, it looks like we got Marty over here. I guess she's waiting for us. But the shutter closed. Nobody's gonna be able to challenge the gym. I've gotta look into this. <laughs> yeah. I just happen to have too many of these, so I'll give you one. Got it? You can handle yourself, right? <laughs> yeah, we got Piers Lee card. <laughs> oh yeah, spoiler alert. Because <laughs> the guy in the Pokemon Center is <laughs> talking about battling Piers. <laughs> Oi! Welcome to Spike Buff, kid! Hope you're ready for the gym mission! Oi! Oh, oh, mate! If you're gonna take on the gym mission, you better change into your uniform. Yeah, so... Yeah, it's kind of funny that we just kind of change into our uniform here without a dressing room. <laughs> uh, if you're looking for the gym leader, he's straight ahead from here. Yeah. Uh, this gym is a dark type gym, so Hitmonlee once again is gonna be the star player in this. <laughs> and yeah, we have our new item. Uh, the... I can find the name of it. Black Belt. <laughs> yeah. So that'll help boost the power of our fighting type moves. Uh, hopefully not too much that we have a really easy time with this gym. <laughs> Gym Challenger, you want to get past me, but I don't want that. Basically, it's a battle between our desires. <laughs> Is it now? <laughs> yeah, you got Galarian Lydoon. Yeah, we've seen plenty of these. Yeah, you're also level 42, so we're once again going to be underleveled for a gym. I'm okay with that. You know, I like a challenge. Yeah, 
And we got Kronos up to level 37 and Kami up to level 40. They actually have been trailing behind in the levels and hey, we're guarding Psychic. Yeah, about time. I am going to definitely get rid of Confusion for that. <laughs> That's not really doing anything for us now. <laughs> You and your Pokemon broke through! <laughs> yeah, we did, didn't we? I don't want to let you through, that's why I was waiting all squeezed in this crack! <laughs> but since I lost, it was really all for nothing! Whatever, you won, so I guess I'll step aside. Yeah, I'm glad you concede. <laughs> yeah. Alright, uh, you guys say anything? Mr. Mime is a dancing Pokemon. It makes for a cheery member of our team. Yeah, I don't think we've seen a Mr. Mime yet. <laughs> Do you know the Pokemon move light screen? <laughs> yeah, I've seen that. <laughs> oh yeah, there's your Mr. Mime. <laughs> there's some kind of invisible wall you can't get through no matter how you try. Yeah, it must be some very, uh, tough puxy glass. <laughs> What's this? A gym challenger made it through? All us Team Yell members have blocked the way! Don't think we'll just let you waltz through! <laughs> yeah, Thievul! Yeah, we haven't seen one of these in a while. I think since Rock 7 when we were training. <laughs> Yeah, we've come a long way since those early days, I'll at least really say that. <laughs> yeah, we got 42 on Akuma and 44 on Bolt Zapper. <laughs> yeah, what's the one to move? Overdrive! I think that's exclusive to Toxtricity. Yeah, it's an 80 power move with 100% accuracy special attack. Uh, user attacks opposing Pokemon by twangling guitar, but yeah, this is really good. Um, uh, kind of tough though, because I like having both a physical and a special electric move. Toxic is really good as well, but I do want this. Because discharge is really good for double battles. Um, Yeah, you know what? We'll override Spark for it. I wasn't able to properly greet you. Yeah. yeah maybe your buddy will be nicer with that. That was totally unbelievable! Even my Pokemon are in all of you and your team. Here, go on through. Check out our neon signs while you're at it. Yeah. Bye bye! Yeah, it's like Mr. Mime's like their mascot Pokemon or something. <laughs> yeah. I'm yelling for no reason! <laughs> That's some entrance there, buddy. <laughs> Did I surprise you? I'm a little surprised how much my legs hurt from not landing. If I stand still like this for too long, it'll hurt so bad I might cry. So I'll shake it off with the battle. <laughs> Ew, you have a Scrafty. Yeah, that could be a problem. Maybe. Or not. <laughs> uh, we get the critical hit. Uh, I don't think it would have mattered if we got that. To be honest. <laughs> yeah, we got Snowball up to level 44 and wants to learn to move Thrash. Uh, yeah, I've talked about this. I don't like moves that go on and on and on. So I'm gonna say no to this one. I lost! My leg pains back, so it's a double shock. <laughs> yeah. Rest that leg if I were you. 
Well, it's true, but I lost, but I pushed through the pains. You should praise me for that. All right, now that the pain's gone, I guess I better get out of here. <laughs> yeah, you do that. <laughs> yeah, doctor's orders, rest that leg up. <laughs> yeah, another max revive. Very nice. Yeah, some kind of invisible wall. We see that. The HP of your Pokemon not looking so good. <laughs> oh, that's some cool backflips. I practice that backhand spring so much, even a pop star would be jealous of those moves. <laughs> Were you surprised? Oi! Be surprised, you! Why, you're not a shock. I'm gonna sneakily win this battle. <laughs> Yeah, I wish my body was that flexible to do that. Because it's not. <laughs> yeah, we got a Weavile. Yeah, our first Weavile. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> yeah, we're thankfully fine here. <laughs> Huh? Seriously? You gotta be kidding! It's over already? What? <laughs> yeah, I posted this on Twitter uh, with the text of, you know, when you uh, record your favorite- when you don't record your favorite TV show and you tune into it and it's almost over. <laughs> yeah, it's, that kind of reminded me of. <laughs> I should have been practicing my battle skills, not my backflip skills! Thanks for showing me that! Guess I'll cheer for you from now on. Yeah, thank you. It's nice to have you guys in my corner now. <laughs> yeah, Himong Lee is not looking so good though. We're gonna heal up. <laughs> ah, looks like this is the end actually. Yeah, let's see what's over here. Team Yow takes the field! This might be the gym challenge, but I won't let you ruin our cool secret hangout. Alright, time for a pincer attack! We'll do whatever it takes to win! Aye! I didn't have enough time to get my disguise ready! That's right, Team Yow is actually made up of Spike Muff gym trainers! Yeah, we got a double battle. I uh, didn't really prepare for this, but I think we'll still be fine. Yeah, I think the Drapion, honestly, is more of a threat. <laughs> and yeah, we have Spirit Break! Uh, we can use that on the Lyapard. <laughs> Pretty cool attacking animation. I guess the first time I've actually seen that. <laughs> yeah, we got a Kuma up to level 43 and Shadow Claw is up to level 45. <laughs> They're becoming a powerhouse, Shadow Claw. <laughs> yeah, I'll do Topher Ball Surrender. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> oh, one HP, man. Uh, that's really close. <laughs> Isn't that Kratos? Hopefully, we can get some experience and level him up more. We got level 38 on them, actually. <laughs> Very good. 
It would have been better if he just lost us. <laughs> Did I lose as a member of Team Yell or was I beaten as a gym trainer? Uh, gee. Both? <laughs> Maybe? Ugh, whatever! Our gym leader's up next, but he's real strong! Got that? I mean, everybody already knew the true identity of Team Yell, right? <laughs> Means I won't get in trouble for not getting my disguise on, right? Sure hope so. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so we got the gym leader next. Uh, I'm gonna heal up first, if that would be wise. I think we could head back to the Pokemon Center, maybe. So I'm gonna do that. So we're not wasting uh, too many healing items. Yeah, you can't ride your bike right now. <laughs> it's truly unfortunate. Yeah, I think we're allowed to head back to the Pokemon Center. If you head back, you'll be retired. You want to retire? Sure. <laughs> Yeah, I think I'm still allowed to go to the end. Because it would be kind of annoying if all, after all of that I would need to rebattle. But I figured I'd at least save my healing items for the battle itself if I need to. Alright, I'll meet you guys back at the end. <laughs> Alright, onwards we go. Shut your gob! Oh, Christine! Ah, uh, I'm really sorry. The not from Spike Muff's telling me they knocked down the city for my sake. Spike Muff just kept getting worse and worse, and all Pierce says is don't worry. So, so we decided to disguise ourselves as Team Yell and sabotage the other challengers. We thought if we could stop the other gym challengers from reaching the gym, that Miss Marty would be the only one to win and make it to the Champion Cup. And we figured that increased the chances of our wonderful Miss Marty becoming the new champion. <sighs> That's no way to help somebody at all! Christy, no need to bother with all the preparations or whatever. Go on in and face the gym leader! Yeah, that we shall. <laughs> Yeah, I think we're pretty good with our team. We're going to be leading off with Akuma. And if we somehow fail with them, uh, our backup's going to be Shadow Claw. And yeah, we need to get Kronos and Kamiya up in levels. Uh, it won't be during this gym, most likely. But, you know, we'll work on that afterwards. Yeah, what's all this commotion over here? Yeah, that's some performance you're putting on there. I wish I could hear what you're saying. <sighs> so you're finally here, huh? See, I'm... I'm really not a great gym leader. Figured that's why nobody was coming to challenge me. I have good ears, so I overheard the whole thing about the city being shut up. When I was alone, it was like my soul was weeping. This is a simple gym stadium. We can't even Dynamax our Pokemon, but well... I still hope you enjoy the battle. Now then... I'm the gym leader of Spike Muff! Piers, the Dark-type user! You want to challenge me, even though you know you'll lose? Then this song's for you, foolish trainer! Get ready for a mosh pit with me and my party! Spike Muff, it's time to rock! Yeah, it's time to rock indeed! We got Gym Leader Piers! Yeah, this is the first and only gym where you aren't allowed to Dynamax your Pokemon. Yeah, it's kinda odd, but alright. Everyone, share my Pokemon! Let's do it! Scrap the Intimidate the opponent! Yeah, that's not good. 
Yeah, start off here, he's got a Scrafty. Level 44. So we're inching pretty close to that. But we should still be fine. Ouch. <laughs> yeah, there's that. Yeah, I did a little more than half damage. Not bad. Oh! We're gonna have to be careful here. Alright, his next Pokemon's gonna be a Malamar. Yeah, I think it's a water dark type? Um, I could be wrong about that. I do need to switch out though, because Puma's not in good shape to take on the next one. Um, that would be Bull Zapper. Malamar's gonna mess you all up with its contrary ability! Oh boy, I can't wait to see it. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> yeah, Malamar is actually a psychic dark type. Yeah, that- I think a first for the entire series of seeing that. It's pretty cool. Uh, it does limit the weaknesses it has. Um, we'll go for Overdrive. We haven't seen the- Attack animation play yet. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Oh! Forgot about that. <laughs> uh, I think we're fine. Yeah, I'm very glad that we outspeed you. Otherwise, we would be in a bind. Yeah, we got level 41 on Kamiya. Obstagoon! This is Ace Pokemon! Yeah! Uh, I think I'm gonna switch out and heal. Yeah, because we're gonna want to hit his Obstagoon really hard with our fighting type move. Yeah, Ace Pokemon is level 46! Time to meet another member of my crew! Face the proud High Roar by Obstagoon! Yeah, it's boring, alright. <laughs> I do have Hyper Potions. I need to be healing more each turn. Yeah, you've got Shadow Claw. Yeah, that's good for type coverage. Yeah, have you met my Brick Break? <laughs> oh! Uh, that's not good. <laughs> Yeah, Obstruct is the dark type version of Protect. <laughs> yeah, I believe it works in the same way with Protect that if you were to use it a second time, it would most likely fail. Yeah, that's a well played move on his part. <laughs> and we're also down. Oh no. Yeah, this is not good. Um. You know what? I think we might be okay with Shadow Claw. Yeah, because he still has one more Pokemon left, so I'm gonna have to go up Akuma. And yeah, you predicted I was gonna attack, and you were totally wrong. <laughs> Yeah, we're better off being on the safe side here. Especially with this Pokemon having hard hits and wow. <laughs> Glad I didn't attack. I wouldn't have liked whatever you were putting out. <laughs> oh! How did we survive that? The heck? <laughs> Alright, we did somehow. 
Yeah, and it outspeeds us. That's... Wow. <laughs> yeah, the fight's not over till it's over. We should be able to have this with Akuma. <laughs> Yeah, I kind of want to see if I can win the fight without using close combat, because that is just kind of a broken move, and it does lower my defenses after use, so we're gonna... Yeah, plus there is the possibility that if we don't want to hit it, that it could counter back the damage. I don't like that. Yeah, it looks like you're going for protection, that's fine. Yeah, we didn't need close combat. <laughs> yeah, Shadow Claw is not getting the experience from this, but at least it gives my other Pokemon a chance to catch up. <laughs> yeah, we got Akuma up to level 44 and wants to learn High Jump Kick. Yeah, this is kind of like a risk reward move. Yeah, so it's got 130 power, it's 90% accurate physical move. However, if it misses, I take damage. Yeah. I mean, it's a good move, but I just... I don't know if I want it right now. Uh, we can go back and relearn it if we change our mind, but... I don't know. We also got Volt Zapper up to level 45, and... His last Pokemon is a Skun Tank. <laughs> yeah, the evolved form of Skunky. I don't do Encores, get it? Not songs, not moves, not Pokemon! Everyone's got a stick, but who cares? Ghost Gun Tank, use your Sucker Punch and Toxic! <laughs> yeah, thanks for outing your strategy. <laughs> yeah, that's... that's something. Um... Ugh. Um... Go for Brick Break and see how much damage this does. Yeah, it's not gonna be super effective because of its Poison Dark typing. But we still should be fine. Oh, I didn't plan for that actually. Oh, but we survived that! Oh! <laughs> yeah, Stunky or Skun Tank has the aftermath ability. Which stinks. <laughs> Literally. Well, I guess I'm not getting the experience from that fight. <laughs> At least the rest of my team that's alive did. Me and my team gave it our best. Let's meet up for a battle again sometime. Yeah. Are you gonna be okay there, Piers? I'm a little worried. <laughs> I'm glad we were able to battle. Seems like my Pokemon feels the same way. Here's your dark badge. Yeah, with that we've gotten dark badge. Yeah, it looks like Team Yellow's not doing so well back there. <laughs> You can now catch Pokemon up to level 55. Here's a uniform, too. I've actually been thinking about just selling them at my concerts. Yeah, got a dark uniform. Model says Marty's gonna challenge me next, I bet. <laughs> that was actually kind of sweet. So you were watching, sis. You won't learn anything from seeing me lose. I was watching your battle, bro! It's how I learned to battle and all that. That right? That reminds me, Arnie, there's something I wanted to tell you. I want you to take over the gym here in Spike Mob as its gym leader. Yeah, I know. You'd plan to retire after the Champion Cup, right? I think you'd really become a great gym leader, even if you don't Dynamax your Pokemon. I love you, but my answer is a big fat NO! I mean, when I end up becoming champion, I won't be able to be a gym leader. 
Good point. In that case, let your big bro see if you have the skill to be a champion. Hey, Christine! Thanks for having an amazing Pokemon battle with my brother. It's my turn next, so clear off for a bit, okay? You seriously beat Piers? Here, a TM to remember this moment. <laughs> yes. <laughs> we got TM85 Snarl. Uh, Beezer yells as if it's ranting about something, which lowers the special attack stat. Yeah, we've seen that. <laughs> Hey, there's some trouble over on Route 9! It's so bad, even the champions come to sort things out! <laughs> oh hey, you gave Piers a thrashing, didn't you? You should head over there to help! Come on then! I'll show you the way. <laughs> yeah, because the game doesn't trust us that we'll make it there ourselves. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, what's going on? <laughs> Christine, thanks for coming, but I've got a handle on this. Whatever's making that noise, I'll see to it. <laughs> I already told you, didn't I? Keep your eye on the goal. <laughs> and for you, that's winning the gym challenge. The only gym badge left is the one you'll get from the dragon gym's leader's Raihan, right? <laughs> Raihan is the only traitor out there I consider a real rival. He's that good, you know. And there I go again. Sorry, but I suppose this is no time for me to be stopping for a chat. There's a bit of trouble here with my name on it. Don't you worry about a thing. The unbeatable champion is here to look after things and keep you all safe. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like you really got a handle on things, Leon. That came from the tunnel, wouldn't you say? Seems I'm about to have a champion time! Yeah. yeah there's not much we can do about that right now, but... I guess explore the town of Spike Muff. <laughs> oh, actually, we gotta make our way back to Hammerlock. <laughs> yeah. Um. Yeah, I think there's something else we can do here now that we've uh, taken on the gym and got the badge. At least I hope I'm not wrong on this. <laughs> Alright, we talked to you. I think it's you, or maybe the one in the corner? I won't quit Team Yo, I'll keep cheering for Marnie. No, not you. I'm looking for a Pokemon trade. How about your Obstagoon for my Cantonian Mr. Mime? Well, if I had an Obstagoon, I would. Because this is the only way to get Cantonian Mr. Mime. Yeah, right then. Come back whenever. Yeah. Yeah, we'll come back with an Obstagoon and do that trade, but not right now, because we don't even have access to getting it. But yeah, we'll remember you for later. Very least. <laughs> Wow, this is a lot of walking on foot. <laughs> uh, talk to you again. Me, I'm just here as a part-time job. I'm but yelling in here for the proper league staff. <laughs> yeah, that's... Alright. Now, what do you say? Even a rundown place like this is important for the people and Pokemon who live here. Yeah, because it's better than being homeless and living on the streets. <laughs> At the end of the day, this place would be more lively if there were more gym challengers. Yeah, <laughs> I'm a huge fan of Piers. I'd really fancy seeing him in more matches. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, do we actually need to heal up our team? <laughs> yeah, the game does it again. It just fully heals our team. Uh, we can at least check out the Mart and see if we're able to get anything new. Uh... Well, we have Hyper Potions and Max Potions. I'm not sure if they were there before, but... You know, at least, uh, we got max potions. <laughs> yeah, 2,500 and Poke Dollars a piece, though. That's... Well... We got our money up now. Uh, we should probably put the amulet coin on 
somebody when we do more battles, but I think we'll be fine otherwise. Alright, I think that about wraps it up for this episode. Next time, we're going to be backtracking through Route 9 back to Hammerlock. I will see you guys then. Bye!